Here's the story of my first fight. So just like last time, in this story, I'm not going to use real names. I'm going to use some fake names. So this story takes place uh, fourth grade elementary school. In elementary school, pretty much at recess, you meet the whole damn school. So everybody know everybody. Okay, so at the time, my little cousin was attending the same elementary school I was. And let's say his name was Tiny. Which is even crazier, he's Puerto Rican. <laughs> Y'all know how black people do. You grew up with somebody for a long time. Now they related to you. You get it. So at this time in elementary school, I got three good friends. There's a dude, let's name him Lizard. He gets all the girls. There's another nigga, let's call him Ben. One last nigga, let's say his name is a nigga with six rings. Now, a nigga with six rings, we was always in competitions. We was good friends, but always in competition. He was faster than me. And like back in the day, if somebody faster than you, they just better than you. Recess and shit, you run around, niggas fast, you lose. Now, he was the second fastest person in the school, actually. Number one was this guy named Yalelele. And number two, it's nigga with six rings. Number three was me. Anyway, back to the story. So, my cousin, Tiny, gets into a fight at recess this day. Cousin Tiny, he whips this dude's ass. He makes him do like a spin a rooney like. Back then in school, somebody started fighting. Everybody running all hype. Oh, everybody amped up. You know, they seen the fight, seen him get his ass whooped. It was great. And with all this animosity up in me now, I just seen somebody get their ass whooped. I'm thinking like, damn, all the bitches on his dick now. If I get into a fight, I whip somebody's ass. They gonna be on my dick. Shit, I can see it now. I could be walking around recess like Ric Flair out this month. Swearing, limousine ride, woo, jet plane flying, woo. And I'm hype. Oh, my cousin just fucked ball up. Oh shit, I'm trying to get into a fight today. Six friends look at me like, let's fight. Come on, what's up? You know, I think he playing. I'm like, ah, all right, all right, cool, whatever. He's like, all right, not right now, after school. All right, whatever. It's over now. We in class, getting ready to get the fuck out of school and all that. So we sitting in class. This nigga look over like, yo, I'm going to beat you up after school. This nigga serious? Now, I'm not nervous because he faster than me. Or that he, cause he bigger than me or anything. I'm actually bigger than him. But I'm nervous because I've never been in a fight before. You know, I was just hyped because the shit was going down. School bell ring, school over. I'm leaving out the side door and shit, you know. And I see a nigga with six rings. So I see him, he start taking his motherfucking jacket off. So I start taking my motherfucking jacket off. What's up, nigga? Say again, we are good friends, so I'm just thinking, like, when he gonna stop, like, pretending like we still fighting, like, like it's a joke and shit. So I go to, like, like approach him and shit, everybody forming a crowd, now everybody's a big-ass circle around us, now everybody looking and shit. Like, back in the day, before you fought, you used to go, like, shoulder to shoulder, and, like, y'all just, like, keep spinning around until somebody, really, like, <laughs> until somebody threw a punch, just, like, a dance and shit. So we did that and shit, we go shoulder to shoulder, and then, like, I, like, I, like, back up, like, to, like, say, all right, it was a joke, it's over. I like I like playing around like I'm a slap boxing and I hit him on the side of his face like where his where his earring was at because obviously he had an earring he was nigga six rings and I paused for one second he socked the shit out of me oh shit nigga glad at that he fucking socked the shit out of me <laughs> yeah, the whole time I'm thinking damn this nigga wasn't playing bro <laughs> so now I get my shit back together my back is against the gate he goes to rush me like he put his head down and like tried to like throw me over the gate. So like me, now I'm like, oh shit, it's a fight. I could finally do what the fuck I wanted to do. So I just started punching him in the back of his head and like in his body because he had his head down because he was trying to throw me over the fence. So after one good like pickup, he tried to do, I, we sprawl, I sprawl. We, well, we both went to the ground and like I'm still hitting him in his back and in the back of his head. I can't get a face shot because, you know, he got his head down. The motherfucking principal came, grabbed me on the shoulder, grabbed him, break us up and shit. I, and I went home. And my jaw hurt it like a motherfucker for like three, four, five days. You know, came to school the next day, and it's that airy silence. So I, 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 that's why I put, I think I lost, because nobody was really talking to me. Like, oh, that's the boy that's getting his ass with me. <laughs> that shit people up if you talking shit about you, they say, oh, you suck this shit out of me. Yeah, that was the story of my first fight. Uh, a nigga with six rings, he socked the shit out of me. And that's it. I'm out.